Happy from the NJCC videos. Today we are doing the contest results as a video because we hit a thousand members in GI Joe Command Central. Yay! And uh, thanks, Matt, for adding some people. That really helped. Yes. Really appreciate Thank that. Thank you, Matt. Thank you so much, Matt. So, to do something extra special, we would like to show you something very important to me. After I got back from my first JoeCon um, in Colorado, I had a bout of migraines. I couldn't watch TV, I couldn't go on the computer, and I really wanted to play with my GI Joes. So, I decided to make a bit of a board game. And um, today we're going to play a little bit of an abbreviated version of that board game in order to determine who gets their first choice on the winner. So um, this board game actually inspired us as well to do our Battalion 13 project. You may have seen on my personal page and you may have seen Twitter, Facebook, whatever, um, about our new project. This is the flyer that you may have seen. Um, we are making a board game. We're making a three and three quarter inch action figure board game for Battalion 13. This is based off of Gandalf Clark's book. It is going to be amazing. And in 11 days, we are launching a radio podcast, a radio play podcast with voices and everything. So if you're interested, you'll be able to see the links in the comments below, we will post those. And um, like I said, we're also making a board game. And the inspiration for that board game came from this board game that um, I created when I had the bout of migraines. So I wanted to celebrate today. And um, so we did the traditional roll dice roll. Um, Mike Samsel got a four. Matt LaCroix got an 18, Tim Tan a 17, Joe Bellamy a 9, Stuart Hickman a 4, Thomas Majestic Beard Coil a 4, and Lenny Allen a 13. So Matthew and Tim, their choices, Zorana and the Baroness, are going to face off um, to see who will get to pick their choice of card art signed by the amazing um, artist at Boss Fight Studios. So, I am going to play Zorana and Gandalf is going to play the Baroness. So we are going to come over here. Like I said, this is just a fun little game that I created when I was out of work for a little while and Gandalf, we are going to roll a d4 to see who gets to go first. I got a one. I got a three. All right, you get to go first. Okay. So in this game, you can only go one turn at a time, and, um, or sorry, one space at a time, So, but you can move any direction. So Gandalf, which way do you so want to go? So I'm going to go to this random chance. Okay, uh, so you get to draw a card. Random a event. Random Actually, event. We, we can't use chance because I think Monop Monopoly has the... Yeah, so we just have little card. You found a there. laptop. Roll a d6, even even number of success, odd number of fail. Use laptop to view an adjacent uh, chance space. You may try once per turn. Okay. So, I get this laptop. Um, do you have the actual? We're not going to use oh, the okay, actual. Okay. We're not going to. This is an abbreviated well, I, I game. I brought this stuff up just in case. But, um, okay, so I have. The, she has a laptop now. We're just going to say she has a laptop. And there's no, well, there's an adjacent ch chance space over here. So you can here, view so can, this chance space. I can, I can view what's in this space if I yep. roll an, a, what is it, an odd? Odd is a fail, even a success. So I got an, I got an even. So I'm going to view what this space has, which yep. is basically the next card. Um, I'm going to avoid this space because it says zombie attack. Okay, but you're not supposed to tell me what it is. Okay, well. So, but we already <laughs> know what it is now. We already know we what know it is now. It's a zombie so attack. It's a zombie attack. Okay. Sorry. So... It's been a while since we played the actual I game. I need to that dice. That's right. You get the you get the dice for the okay. D6. Right. Okay. So. Okay. So it's my turn now, and I'm going to go for weapon space. Okay. You have found a gun. Add a D6 to your attack roll. 
So I'm just going to so, save that. And then add a d6. To yes. When I, okay. when I attack. So, so I'm going to go to this star space next. Star space is a safe place. Um, it just says safe space. Uh, you cannot be attacked here. You may not attack from this space. Yeah. That's what that says. So I am on a, I am on a safe space where I cannot be attacked. Why move? Yeah, why move? Yeah. Anyway, next. All right. So I'm going to do the same. I'm going to move to a star okay. space. What did you find? Oh, just another safe space. Okay. So, we'll so we just, both have safe spaces. We'll just have like a But in the in the in the interest of moving the game forward, yeah. I'm going to go to actually I'm going to view this this uh, chance space with my dice if I can. Oh, I didn't, can't do it. I got a five. All right. Okay. So then I'm going to I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna chance it. Okay. Using that word again. <laughs> Alright, you have found a weapons cache. Share with your team by moving them to an adjacent space. Each gun has 1d6 to your attack. So basically, I, I have another gun, so I, I need, I need, I'll just use the same d6 for yep. attack. Yep. Uh, so it's your turn. Alright, I am going to move to this weapon space. Well, it looks like we're about Matthew to face Matthew LaCroix off. asks, what's up? What's up, Matt? We are, hey, Matt. We are playing some games here. Looks like you're going to be able to choose your choice uh, if you win. So, let's see here. I have found a laptop and a gun. I may look at an adjacent chance card once per turn and add an, a d6 to all of my attacks. Basically, you can use the same dice. So, I also get to look at this space. Okay, um, you have this one. Okay, my vehicle has broken down. You well, don't I don't have space. a vehicle, so, there so you go. that's good. Just leave that there. Find a tool to there. fix it on a chance card. Okay, so so leave, so leave it there. No, no, this is just what happened to me. If oh, oh, oh! Actually, right. I wasn't supposed to read it. I, I did, did it the same too. Thing. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. <laughs> well, now we're facing off. So I am. Are you going to attack me? I I am going to attack you. All right. So all right. So, so I am going I have... to attack you with. Uh, what do I? What do I roll with? A twenty. All right. So each character gets one d twenty plus. You can use whatever. You're, weapon. You're, uh, you're, you're, you're we attack. What weapons do you have? I have just a weapons cache. That's what it says. So okay, I, so you get one d six. For me, yeah. I, I have get two people that I, I have get two d sixes and a d twenty. Wow. So, you okay. sure you want to fight? You ready? Yeah, yeah. All right, let's, let's do go. It. All right. Oh, I got a ten. I think you won. Yep. So it's seventeen eighteen. Okay, that means Zarana won, which means Matthew won. Matt LaCroix, Congratulations, you Matt! You have one, which means you get to choose between the uh, two card arts that were posted. Um, so I'll send you a little message and you can let me know. And then we'll need your address and all that stuff too. Yep. That, that'll be in the message. Yep. So uh, you'll get the signed card art by James Griffiths. And Tim, uh, Tan, you'll also get signed card art by James Griffiths. So thank you very much for watching this video and we hope that you will take some interest in the Battalion 13 project, which is near and dear to our hearts, inspired by everyone at GI Joe and inspired by Gandalf's book, Battalion 13, which is gonna be the radio play podcast. Which, a uh, little inside in tip on that, days. which I'm only gonna say here for right now. Battalion 13 is what I used to do with my figures when I wanted to actually have them be in my own universe. Yeah. So when I wasn't playing G.I. Joe or when I was combining the characters with the G.I. Joe characters, I had characters with special powers fighting demons and vampires and that was what I did with my G.I. Joe figures. And in 2001 I wrote a book but I never did much with it except for copywriting. So that's pretty much where we're at with that. And yep. we're doing it as a podcast with voices and everything. It's going to be great. Yep. So Matthew LaCroix says, oh wow and thank you so much. Happy awesome. Day. Thank you. We'll see you soon, Matthew. Uh, and? Yep. And